Some such aerosol cans contain a liquid propellant. The propellant exists inside the can as a liquid and a vapor. Explain what happens when such an aerosol can is heated to about 900 Kelvin. I have got a simple, simplified diagram of the can here with the liquid propellant and some of its particles as a vapor inside the can. When, when the can is heated, the particles inside gain kinetic energy. So the liquid particles in there will start to move faster and the ones which are energetic enough near the surface will evaporate to become gas particles. And this will increase the number of particles, uh, gas particles in the can. So if we look back to the gas equation, PV is N KT, where N was the number of particles there. Particles. Well, because of the heating, we can see that temperature goes up and also we have seen that the number of air particles in there will increase so n will increase because some particles from the liquid evaporates and then there are more air particles so without the liquid prop propellant the there was only the temperature increase which resulted the pressure to go up but now in the ideal gas equation n is also increasing so we have another um, reason for the pressure to go up so the increase in pressure would be more rapid compared to the um, non-liquid propellant and it would uh, explode even um, faster so without reaching about 900 Kelvin so to summarize we need to say that the atoms or molecules gain kinetic energy and they evaporate as a result number of gas particles increases and that's the increase in N which makes pressure increase due to both rise in T and N and the result of this would be that explosion at a temperature of lo lower than 900 Kelvin.